This is a quick review of something I bought recently on Amazon and it just arrived. It took about two weeks to arrive because it was coming from mainland China. These are LED tail lights, surface mount. And I like that because uh, that's good for trailers, boat trailers, utility trailers, jeeps, you know, motorcycles, whatever. And I like LED lights, tail lights, because they don't draw much current. They never burn out. Actually, theoretically, they would, but they take at least $50,000 to do so. And under normal usage. And your vehicle or your trailer will wear out long before these do. Also, they're, they're tough and waterproof, you know, speaking generally of LED lights. The problem is that most of them are expensive. And usually something along the lines of $20 each or thereabouts, maybe more depending on what they are. And another problem is most of them you buy the lights and then you have to buy something to use to mount them too. I like these because they have a their surface mount. They have a built-in flange. And so all you've got to do is drill either two or four. You can just go with two, you know. Four would probably be better. But two or four mounting holes and maybe a three-eighths or a half-inch hole to feed the wires through, although you could just use a spacer. You know, maybe use some washers to stand it off a little bit, and then put a bead of silicone or something around, or, you know, stick on foam or whatever to, uh, to seal behind it. Although it doesn't necessarily have to be sealed behind it, because it's, uh, it's waterproof from the back, too, so, you know... It uh, probably will uh, beef it up a little bit mechanically, though, if you put something behind it so it's not vibrating. Enough of that. Uh, the price of these is uh, quite good. And I see that the price seems to fluctuate, but it's still pretty cheap for the pair. Less than $20. Unless it goes up... Uh, radically pretty soon it'll be less than twenty dollars for a pair it comes with eight sheet metal screws for mounting they don't feel as light as some of the Chinese screws I've seen some of them seem to be made of aluminum or something I don't know but uh, these feel like decent quality screws Okay, I think the wiring might be incorrect. It seems like, if I'm rem remembering correctly, by U.S. standards, the, the white is usually ground, I believe. But in these, that's not the case. This, this follows standard, more standard DC power uh, specs were, you know, I mean... Usually, if you see, like, for example, a utility light will usually be black and red, where black is ground and red is positive. And, uh, but that's usually not the case with tail lights. But with this, the way it's set up is black is the ground, red is the tail light, and white is the brake and turn light. And I'm going to demonstrate for you. Now in a lot of LED tail lights it'll have a, a separate set of brighter LEDs for the the brake and tail function. I mean brake and turn function. But with these it seems that it's uh, it's powering the same LEDs it's just using uh, higher value resistors for more current apparently so that's red that's your 
tail running light so that's black to ground and red to positive okay so connect the white and you can see it gets significantly brighter but I'll show you what I was talking about with using the same LEDs as opposed to a separate set of LEDs it's not a problem it's just a point of interest but you see with the tail and brake light on make contact with with the red wire and nothing whatsoever happens that's because it is using the same LEDs but like I said not a problem it works fine I'm sure that's part of the reason they're so inexpensive but there's really no drawback to it so overall I give these a big thumbs up I'll probably buy some more of them and I will include a link in the video description if you want to buy some of these I'd appreciate it if you would buy them through my link and uh, I think they'll do well for you I think they're gonna do well for me